Hey everyone, it's Maddie here with Rigid, and thanks for tuning in to another Job Site Live. We're here in our global headquarters in Elyria, Ohio at our Schoolhouse Training Center. And today we're super excited to talk to you about our newest uh, camera reel on our line, the Rigid Sea Snake Mini Pro, and our software Rigid Connect, and we're gonna talk about how they integrate seamlessly together. We have Kelsey and Brad here to do that for you. But before we get started, we're gonna go, go through a few housekeeping items. First, if you have any questions, we obviously encourage them, throw them in the chat, or utilize the um, question mark icon at the bottom of your screen, and we'll do our best to get to them all at the end. Um, and second, a few lucky viewers will be randomly selected to win some rigid hoodies. Um, and with that, I'm gonna go ahead and turn it over to Kelsey to kick us off. Thanks, Manny. Hi, I'm Kelsey. I'm the product manager of Diagnostics, and today we're gonna go over our newest camera reel, the Mini Pro. And what it's, what's exciting about the Mini Pro is it's the first camera reel to have digital self-leveling. So in comparison to the traditional soft leveling camera head, the leveling is done digitally. There's no moving parts, as in the traditional, that would um, have to catch up. So it's our most stable um, in-pipe view that you will have today. So we're gonna take a look and we're gonna compare the new Mini Pro to the um, Mini, and you'll see that they are in the same body, the same frame. They are both 26 pounds. They both have 200 feet of our mid-stiff push cable. And another similar thing is that they have the uh, sonde built into the camera head. Now what's different from the Mini Pro and the Mini is the Mini Pro is gonna have a smaller camera head. The Mini has your 30 millimeter camera head and the Mini Pro has a 25 millimeter camera head. So it can go down to an inch and a half to eight inch of pipe capacity. Another difference you'll see with the camera head is that since all of the, the leveling is done digitally, we're able to take out the moving parts. So the benefit of that is less repairs, but also the camera head is shorter. So it's a little more flexible and can hit the bends a little easier. So we're gonna take a look over on the monitors of what the digital self-leveling looks like in comparison to the traditional. So on the left-hand side, you have digital self-leveling, and you'll see that the image stays in the center at all times. And then on the right, we have our traditional self-leveling, and you'll see as the weight in the mechanical parts catches up, there's a little twitch. So side by side, this is our smoothest, most stable leveling offered on our sea snake camera reels. All right, so let's go ahead and And then we're gonna take a look at the monitor. So this has our TrueSense features. So down here in the left, you'll see our tilt sense inclinometer. It tells you at what angle you are in the pipe and um, there's the counter cable counter as well. This also has uh, the HDR, the high dynamic range, giving you the clearest pipe image. So we can toggle it on and off and you can see the difference with the HDR. It's a lot clearer, you can see a lot further. Another new feature with the digital self-leveling is our monitors are now gonna have digital zoom and pan. So in order to access this, you'll click on the right hand um, arrow, you'll go down to the magnifying glass, you'll click on that, and it opens up a screen where you can zoom in on a point of interest, and then you can toggle by hitting the middle button to pan over to your point of interest. And if you hit the middle button, you toggle back to zoom, you can zoom back in, and you can toggle back over to pan to focus in on any point of interest that may um, stick out to you. So not only does digital self-leveling work on our sea snake monitors, you can also use it in the HQX um, live app. So we're gonna show you on the iPad. You'll see that you are live streaming the same view and you'll get your digital self-leveling just as you would on the monitor. So with um, this digital self-leveling and TrueSense features, you need to make sure that you have a TrueSense enabled monitor in order to access them. Um, 
And when you use the CSNIC monitor, you can use your USB to transfer um, your images and recordings to your computer in order to send them. Brad's also going to go over um, a different method if you're using HQX Live. So I'm going to throw it over to Brad. Hi, everyone. I'm Brad Yernich. I'm the Director of Software Development. So I'm going to talk to you a little bit about Rigid Connect. Uh, Rigid Connect is a subscription-based site that we have. It lets you create branded, professional-looking reports that you can share with your customers and clients. And you can attach all of your job site media, whether it be your videos off of your uh, CSNIC equipment or just any images or files that you've captured related to the job. Um, so there's a few other things uh, that you can do with Connect. You can control access to all of the videos. So if you want to put limits on how long someone can have access to it or look at it, you can do that. Uh, you can also just use it as backup site for all of your files. Uh, and so there's a couple of different things you can do with that. So when Kelsey was showing you the features of the Mini Pro, she was looking at it on the monitor and you can certainly use that. You can record to USB devices, but I'm gonna show you, I was recording on HQX Live while she was doing that. And I'll show you how that interacts with Rigid Connect. So let me just switch one thing here. Um, I have the HQX Live app on my iPad. I also have the Rigid Connect app. Uh, there's Android and iOS versions that you can choose from. And when I'm looking at the video that I have here, I've got a couple things that I can do. Uh, you can certainly add captions and describe the videos. You can also decide that you're ready to share this. So I've got my little share icon here. And when I choose that, you can get all of the normal options like text message, email, wherever you want to send it. But I'm going to send it over to Rigid Connect. When I do that, I can attach it to an existing report or choose a new one. So I'm just going to type that this is my job site live report. And I'm going to select someone that I want to share it with. And we're going to send it over to Maddie today. And as soon as I hit save, and add, it's uploading my video to the report that I've created, and it pops up that it's ready to go. I can send it to whoever over email or text, whichever I choose, and it's as simple as hitting send. Now, she's received both an email and a text message on her device. Uh, that is going to look like this. So it's going to be branded with my company logo at the top, the description that I typed in, my contact information, and all of the files and videos that I've attached. So your customer can view this on their computer, mobile device, whatever it is that they have. And as soon as they click on that, the video is just gonna play within their phone. They don't have to download anything or um, have anything pre-installed. It just plays nicely and they can see it along with all of the uh, descriptions and text that you entered. So that's uh, the quickest way that you can send a report. Um, there's certainly more options. So we have a full website that you can also go to and do all of the editing there. If there's additional things that you wanna do, create some navigation throughout the videos. But if you just want the quickest way while you're in the field to send a report, that's what we just demonstrated. Awesome. And I think we have a few questions, if we're good with that. Nice. All right, so first question. Can I use the new C-Snake Mini Pro with my existing monitor? Yes, you can use your um, Mini Pro with any TrueSense enabled uh, C-Snake monitor. So any of the CSX series will be able to um, enable the TrueSense and digital self-leveling. Cool, cool. Okay, another question. Um, okay, so how do I know what software is on my monitor though? Sure, so if we take a look down at the monitor, and we go into the menu button. We scroll down to the information button with the eye icon, and it'll show you that we currently have 2.18.34. That's the software um, available right now that will allow for digital self-leveling to work on your monitor. 
Um, you can either do this update through a push update with the QR code that comes attached to the reel. If you scan this, it'll take you to the C-Scan support website where you can download and put it on a USB drive and plug it into your monitor and it'll automatically update. Or if you want to use the push update with one of your mobile devices, if you go into your menu button and scroll down, you'll see there's downloads available, the version 2.18.34. And um, once that's downloaded, you'll see that it says next time you're connected, it'll automatically update. So the next time I connect to this monitor, it's gonna start downloading the update. And then once I get the notification on the monitor, it's updated. If I go into that menu that we just went over on the monitor, I can verify that I have that version. Great. Um, we have a few questions um, about Rigid Connect. So how does access to Rigid Connect work? Sure, so if you go to the website, you can sign up for a 14 day trial. And then after that, it goes to a monthly subscription starting at $49. Uh, that gets you uh, five users and uh, roughly like 100 hours worth of video storage. Certainly after that, if you need to increase, you can do that. So does that mean there are multiple subscription levels? Yes, there are subscription levels. We encourage starting with basic um, because that provides everything you need to get going and it's really just the users or the amount of storage you eventually get to that would drive a change or an upgrade. Cool. Um, what do the reports look like? Yeah, so the reports, uh, they're branded with your company logo. So that's one of the first things that you wanna do when you'll create an account is switch out the Rigid Connect logo for your company. Uh, and then all of the reports that you share over text message, they come from a nice 855 number that says it's your company. That way it's not heavily branded rigid or anything. It all looks like it's coming from your company. Nice. Um, can I only use this with rigid cameras? No. So the site accepts any type of video file as well as images that you've either captured, of course, with your C-Snake equipment, but you can also use digital cameras, your smartphone, uh, whatever it is that you have, you can also attach any sort of file. So PDFs, Excel sheets, whatever it is, uh, invoices, uh, if you want to attach that and send it along with the report, drawings that you've done and scanned in, whatever it is, the site and the report accepts. Nice. Um, okay, another good question. How does this differ from YouTube, Dropbox, or maybe Google Drive? Yeah, so each of those sites kind of have an area that they specialize in and Connect is really the purpose-built piece of software for working with inspection media that takes the best of each one of those and combines it into one site. So if you think about YouTube, they've taken out how to stream video, but you can't really attach other things. You don't have other files, you can't attach images, you can't do you know, security and controls, things like that. Connect provides that for you all with allowing you to brand it. And then things like Google Drive and Dropbox, they're gonna take care of you know, storing some of those files and doing the backups for you, but they're really not gonna let you customize it and uh, take care of any of the streaming issues. So Connect gives you that one place to go to that's gonna, you know, be purpose-built and streamline what you need to do with your inspection videos to get those out to your customers. Nice. Um, oh, this is a good one. So, seem like this is a really good uh, software, but like, how do I get started with it? Yeah, so we encourage everyone to go out to the website. We've got a getting started video that you can watch and it kind of takes you through the you know, simplest things that you need to do to get going. There's also a big button on there that says book a demo. So you can do that. It's tied into our calendar here and any time slot that's open, just get set up for that and we'll go through, we'll take you through everything you need to get going. We'll show you uh, our screens and how it works, and we'll take those 30 minutes, whatever it is that we need, and we'll get you set up and started. It's free to do, so start that trial, book a demo with us, we'll get you going, and we'll be there to help. Great. Uh, scrolling through the chat, uh, looking at the question icon, it looks like we don't have any more questions. So, with that, we are going to end our job site live. Thanks so much for tuning in. Um, if you have any more questions about the Rigid Sea Snake Mini Pro, about the Rigid Connect, feel free to shoot us a DM, go on our website, um, or contact your local authorized Rigid dealer. Um, and with that, thanks so much for joining and make sure you tune in next time.